Hi, this is Debbie with Food Prepping Channel, and today I'm going to try something in my Ninja Foodie, and I'm going to bring y'all along to show you to see if it works. Um, I have tried, I love Brussels sprouts, and I have tried Brussels sprouts in my air fryer, and I couldn't get them, I don't like them tough, I like them soft but the I don't know how to explain it it's roasting them is more like it more like I like them um, but I want to be able to use my Ninja Foodie my air fryer and this and that so I'm going to I've got two pounds of Brussels sprouts in here that I've um, taken the ends off and cut in half and I'm going to try this. I'm going to cook these in my Ninja Foodie, which you could use your Instant Pot, the same thing. I'm gonna do cook these in the Ninja Foodie for two minutes under pressure. Then I'm gonna let them come down from pressure. And then I'm going to um, try, put them, drain them and put them in the uh, air fryer part of the Ninja Foodie and see if I can get them crunchy and they still be soft in the middle and crunchy on the outside. So I've got this. This has been, um, it's got about a cup of water in here and two pounds of the Brussels sprouts. All right, make sure that your um, vent thing is set to sealing and um, not venting and then I'm going to see if I can't get it down anybody I know y'all can see when I turn it on okay now it's on and I'm gonna put it on pressure high for two minutes and press start and I'm gonna do this. I want to see. I'm just doing an experiment. I want to see how this is gonna turn out. So I'll bring you back when I get ready to um, go to the next part. Okay, I'm back, y'all. Um, I did exactly two minutes on these, and then let the the pressure out. And I think that these are going to be. Some of them are still hard but some of them aren't so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to let the water out drain these and then I'm going to put them in a bowl with some oil I'm gonna dry them off or whatever and then put them in a bowl with some oil and then put them in the air fryer and we're gonna fry them and see if we can get them real crunchy but soft in the middle so I will bring you back okay y'all all right it's in the fry fry basket now I dried it off I put about a teaspoon of kosher salt on here and probably just a quarter of a teaspoon of um, coarse ground black pepper all right now I'm going to spray this with this great value olive oil I'm going to spray all over it and see if I've got all the leaves and now I'll, I'll everything that was in the the um, when I did the pressure cooking is in here so I just sprayed that now what I'm going to do is I've got to close this lid remember this is the ninja foodie but you also can use you could do your use your instant pot and then your air fryer because most people have a um, have an air fryer in these days and so the your instant pot and most people have an instant pot too so you can use your instant pot and your air fryer all right so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut this on I'm gonna put it on air crisp 
it's on 390 I'm gonna take the temperature up to 400 and let's see what, how, what the time is the time is 20 minutes I don't think I'm going to need that long but remember with the ninja foodie you can lift the top and see so I'm gonna be checking it and moving it around and all that so um, all right I will bring you back it's on 20 minutes now so I will bring you back okay it's been 10 minutes and I really don't <laughs> they're not getting crispy not yet but I mean I think that they probably will in here I think it they probably well it looks like some of them are so I'm going to spray some more spray on here olive oil spray I'm gonna close the lid and let this go and now check it probably in five minutes and I'll bring y'all back okay y'all can see it did it did get um, pretty brown toasty so I'm going to that was 20 minutes on the air fryer so I'm gonna get some out and put them on my plate and taste them and I'll bring I mean and I'll bring y'all back when I get that done okay y'all I'm back all right so here's the Brussels sprouts um, I'm gonna taste them and see if they're what they taste like they've got to be better than they were the last time I fixed them in the air fryer all right, let me taste them. Oh, yeah. See, here's the... Some of the leaves are crisp. Well, let me just drop it in fourth. Um, some of the leaves are crispy. And that's what I like. Mm. But I like it done in the middle as well. So... this worked out good it really did mm. they're done in the middle and summer you've got the crispy leaves mm, mm -mm. I just love Brussels sprouts I do and this is one of the sides that you can make that go with just about anything you can cook I think it would be really good with chicken and mashed potatoes mm, mm -mm. it will be really good right now mm. all right mm. if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel look below to for links look below to links to my Facebook my Twitter and my Instagram also there's links that um, are different things that I use in my kitchen that I purchased at Amazon and you can um, purchase those too so I hope you have a good day and I'll talk to you later bye